The world you think you know can change in the blink of an eye by coincidence, chance, or even dog poop. Actually, that's how it happened to us. We met at the Friends of Greyhounds Rescue Kennel Club, where former racers are retired for various reasons, due mainly to injury and poor performance on the track. In other words, greyhounds either win and make money for the owners or get kicked out and look for someone else to feed them. There was a lot of excitement when the dogs were let out of their cages and into the enclosed yard for viewing and exercise. How do we make a choice? Picking a lifelong companion on such short notice and first sight is not easy and pretty scary. It's like picking a winner in a crowded race, only the race is not over in 32 seconds. It's permanent, a commitment for life. How did we know if we were going to be suited to each other? Well, after watching and evaluating for about an hour, and with our fingers and paws crossed, we finally paired up and started home in the car. We were about to begin the tricky steps of adapting and living together in a small condo. Now begins the process of sniffing and exploring that occurs before being satisfied and comfortable with new surroundings. We usually start the day at about 7 a.m. This morning, something new appeared. Two huge fish leaping out of the sand. If you examine them up close, you'll see they're made from plastic water bottles. At this hour, the sun is just starting to creep up on the horizon over the ocean and is highlighting the bottom of the clouds with shades of red, yellow, and orange. It's a lovely time of day, breezy, warm, and smelling of salt air. In a matter of minutes or so, the sun will be clear of the clouds and start to throw shadowy images of everything it hits in its path as it slowly travels higher in the sky. Every shadow is grotesquely elongated to the point of caricature, including us. It's awesome. We both need exercise and the best place is a park of course, with other dogs, where off comes the leash and it's running free time. Dog meeting is simple. Walk over to someone new, stick your nose in their butt, take a whiff, and turn around so they can meet you. <laughs> Get right to it. What else do you have to know? Sometimes it's an instant attraction and you know where that can go. Then it's all about chasing the small dogs that look like rabbits and are easy to catch and torment. It's not at all like people meeting people ritual. What a difference. You know, you say, hello, how you doing? Pleased to meet you, as if you really mean it. And then awkwardly talk about the weather. You haven't learned a thing about them. This park also has a lake for dogs only and is perfect for cooling off after a chase. Every day we go for walks at different times along the beachfront. There are so many new and constantly changing sights and people to see. And then there are those we recognize day to day because they are, mm, let's say, somewhat different. One of the regulars is a guy I call the Birdman of Beachfront. He's out there every day in the same place, feeding dozens of pigeons, sparrows, and seagulls who depend on him for food. When they get hurt, he fixes their wings and feet. I don't think they don't appreciate what he does. They thank him the only way they know how, by crapping on him and his car. Mm. He gets angry when we walk by because his pigeons panic and fly away and can't crap on him anymore. 
great fun. Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. They put up a wooden statue of him nearby. If you can mm, use well, maybe it's not him, news, but it sure looks like Bombay. him. Come on and fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. Oh yeah, here comes another regular, the chewing lady. She's always chewing a huge glob of what I assume to be gum. She's a fast walker type who chews on the beat of her stride and looks like a football linebacker. Get out of her way. Exercising on the beach is maybe the best way to work out. And the man you're looking at is the health colonel. He's a former U.S. Army colonel who devotes much of his time getting people to live a better lifestyle through rigorous exercise classes, which he conducts in groups or individually. With the next exercise, we're gonna honor man's best friend. The next exercise is called Dirty Dogs. In this case, you need to utilize your visualization skills. Imagine you have a fire hydrant next to your right leg. Raise that leg up smartly, just like you've seen on Animal Planet, and lower it back down. Here we go. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're kind of an icebreaker pair because between the two of us, we attract a lot of attention and conversation from perfect strangers. Now here's an example. Hi there. You're so cute. Would you like to come home with me? Would you like to come home with me? Hi there. You're cute. You live around here? You married? You know what's great fun? Once a week, we go to play at the amateur highlight court in North Carolina. Throwing and catching is exciting and fantastic exercise. We love playing together. It's about four years since we got together, and it's hard to tell who adopted whom. And that's a good thing. We've both changed a great deal since we started out together in the sense that we're calmer, more friendly to people we meet, and of course the exercise we get on our outings is great. Now it's time for our late afternoon walk along the intracoastal. It's cooler now, and the sun in the west is slowly sinking towards the horizon. With its last rays of the day as it shines on us, it paints different elongated shadows as it did in the morning. Oh, I meant to tell you, that's me on the right. If I could give you one thing in life, I would give you the ability to see yourself through my eyes. Only then would you realize how special you are to me.
back But I need some conversation Get me back in the black I take a money paper from the top of a stack I read the situation from the front to the back The only job that's open needs a man with an axe So I put it right back in the rack Jack, choo-choo Choo-choo, jaboogie, woo-woo Woo-woo, jaboogie, choo-choo Choo-choo, jaboogie, tear me right back